Hi everyone, uh, I'm Garrett. This is the Amazing Garrett Show, and I'm gonna I'm finally bringing you an update to uh, the Bismarck build. Um, when I set out on this adventure, I didn't realize how popular it was. Um, I apologize um, that you know it's it's been so long um, with the current things going on in the world right now. Uh, that's kind of why it's been taking me forever to get this video out. Uh, children being in homeschool, you know, uh, loss of a job, kind of stuff like that, um, you think would make more time uh, available for me, but it actually absorbed more time. Um, so I appreciate your understanding, and here we go. We're going to get into this. So, okay, so where we last started out. Uh, the Bismarck wasn't even uh, close to this point. Okay, so you can see that I have um, the scale deck um, attached to the Bismarck hull. I have it painted. Um, I've left the turrets. Um, free floating so they can move when I want to pose them. I mean, you guys can see that I still have so much to do, um, but I, I wanted all of um, them to, to turn. Um, I thought with the way uh, it goes together, I should leave these in here. Um, I have test fitted uh, the, the structure to make sure that that doesn't get in the way. Um, I do have all of them painted. I'm not, I apologize, I'm not sure where, oh, it's inside. Um, Cesar will be, uh, inside. But, um, so, if there's any questions on, uh, the red is Tester's red hole. Um, and then the white is just a matte white from, uh, sp spray paint, uh, from Walmart. Uh, the gray is a gray, a gray matte from Walmart. So is the black. Um, this, this gray here is the original, uh, model gray color that, um, that the model comes in basically. Sorry, let me just move the camera over here. Um, so I had just taken the tiny um, uh, hobby hobby uh, tape, and that's where I've got just the single thickness here um, that runs. Um, it ran all the way down. Um, uh, hall. I had done that and then I spray painted it. Um, that was super tricky. I suggest that if you guys have a different way of doing it, should probably do it the other way you're thinking because this was actually really difficult. Um, there are some spots where it's not so great and some spots I still need to clean up. Um, so this, the Bismarck down here, it came with, um, the boat but before um, I was a welder in my profession so I made this is just a base plate of metal um, I went to Dollar Tree or a hobby store oops, and just got those uh, framing um, spacers that you'd use for picture frames um, I mean, so I just have it, I, I went kind of full out and I did, um, like a nut and bolt for each side. Um, so you can see down in there and this was due to my space and because I don't know if you guys have gone through, I'm just knocking everything over. Sorry. Um, the, 
the rudders were a nightmare and I kept breaking them off. So that's why I built the platform that it's sitting on. So it's up off the ground or up off my table, my desk. Um, and it's, I mean, it's nice and sturdy. Um, it allows me to work up higher. Um, just kind of as a, a better fit. Um, just to make it more streamlined for me so I can, you know, build up and do all, do all the superstructure stuff. Um, so yeah, it's a lot to catch you guys up on. Um, it's just been so long. I continued the build just because, um, you know, there for a while I wasn't sure if I was going to continue the channel. Um, I mean, that's why there's a lot of gaming videos is because they're really easy for me to put out. Um, but then I saw the overwhelming, um, positive response that I was receiving on the boat, on the Bismarck. And, um, I, I knew that I had to continue, um, building it for you guys. So, um, at least it's not done. I mean, there still is a lot to do, so there will be a lot more videos. Um, and as you can see, I've got kind of pieces, pieces everywhere. But, uh, yeah, there's so much to do just on the deck, let alone, uh, the superstructure. Um... Superstructure is mostly built, um, and I'll go over that in each one of its own videos. Um, the very fiddly parts. Um, some of it, just due to time and my lack of experience. Um, I'll show you on the two. Okay, sorry, I'm still holding the tripod here. Um, so... Use this little screwdriver as a pointer. Um, so on on Anton, you can see that I've got you know the the photo etch on it. Um, on oh the B escapes me. Berta, Bruno, I think it's Bruno. Sorry, um, I kind of skipped it. And I apologize for that. That's kind of a, it's a rookie hobby move. Um, but my experience level, <laughs> uh, please forgive me. Um, I promise I'll be better uh, going on in the future. Um, so yeah, so again, this was just a catch up video. Uh, I'm gonna stand up and kind of back up now so you can kind of get the whole, the whole view of it there. So there she is. And her unfinished glory. Um, so yeah. So let me kind of switch it back to me. Okay. So there it is. I hope. I know it's just a real quick. Uh, it's not a real quick video. But just going over what I've done so far. Catching you guys up to speed. I, I promise that I'm going to keep building it. Um, just family comes first. And I hope you guys understand. Um, I did find out something very interesting today. I don't want to give too much personal information about myself, but um, my last name, uh, there was a gentleman um, that served on the Bismarck as a sailor. Um, we share the same last name. Now, I'm not saying that I'm, it's very distantly related if we're related at all. I don't know how that works. But it's just really odd because the way I spell my last name, most of the time and most of the research that I've done, they drop the Y on the end. Well, the gentleman named Wilhelm, um, he had the Y. So it was kind of a little more special to me that, oh wow, somebody with the same last name, relation or not, it's just really cool. I found that out today doing some research. Um, so I'm going to be contacting the German version of the National Archives uh, to see if they have a service photo of him or something um, that I can incorporate into the build. Um, if you guys are still interested in it, if I haven't lost you guys yet, uh, please go over. I did finish the Amanti uh, U-boat as well. 
um, and I'm gonna do go over there check out that video um, something I did with the stand like what I have the Bismarck mounted on I did that for the U-boat um, but there's kind of an extra flare that I did to that base so go over there check it out I plan on doing that with the Bismarck um, I'll probably do Lucian's and Lindemann being the commander and captain of the Bismarck um, it'll be like a black and white photo I'll probably have a little like um, service tag kind of thing if you guys um, follow the Hachette build they give that data plate something I kind of want to do for the Bismarck uh, I got enough I got enough space and we'll see um, so yeah so kind of scattered scattered video um, it's running a little long now but promise you guys you will see more in the future I just want to get this out there um, again thank you so much for the response I uh, almost 60 subscribers that's crazy thank you so much um, so yeah just please stay tuned be patient with me uh, we will get it out I'll go into more detail um, when I break down the superstructure and anything further uh, I'll film it um, so this I'm Garrett this is the amazing Garrett show thank you for tuning in check you later